Well, it was exciting to have two of the top teams in the conference come all the way down just to see the course. So that was exciting. We were looking forward to it. Obviously, Gianna had a nice breakout for, for her as an individual, and that's something that we had actually talked about, just taking a little more risk on her end. So that was exciting to see. And um, a couple of our uh, returners, you know, they, they ran with their heart and they ran tough. So, you know, we've got a little more work to do. Um, but, you know, there was a few individuals that really stepped up for the team that, that was, it was good to see that. I wanted to stay with what, like a couple of the teammates. So I, you know, kind of like fell out the race and saw how everyone was like going out. So it was more me and Jill stuck together and she was like my motivation. I saw like during the race and then we really used each other to like push, you know. So, and then it was a lot of Liberty girls. So we, we had to tackle that, but overall, like, you know, you just gotta pick them as you go. We had a couple that didn't really follow the game plan. That, was, that wasn't that was great, but um, that's what these meets are for. So it's a good opportunity for us to learn from, from this. Uh, we had a couple guys that, that did all right. Uh, we were missing a few guys, so we'll look very different when we get to November 2nd. Um, but I thought they competed well considering some of the conditions and some of the things that happened. The crowd was good. The, the weather was fine and the course was fine. I think it's a good preparation for the conference and we'll, we'll be having a good conference. We work as a team, it's a teamwork, so trying to push each other throughout the race for the benefit of the team and everybody to perform well. So it's about like putting in the work as a team, because cross, cross country is a team, team, team team effort like yeah okay so the beauty of our sport is every regular season meet doesn't count towards anything in terms of scoring it's just an opportunity for us to learn about ourselves and about our team and find the holes that we need to work on and address those throughout practice so that in the day that we need to be ready November 2nd we will be um, and that's when it'll all come together so I think for us, you know, we're in some heavy training right now. This is not something, these two races we didn't peak for. It's not something we were like trying to, you know, peak for, but um, there was some, some things that we learned about ourselves and then going into UF, we can, we can apply some things in practice. And then Louisville, obviously, we have a little bit more time to train and work on, on a few things as a team. So, so yeah, looking forward to Louisville. I learned a lot from my first one. So I think that was like a good starting point. Uh, and, you know, I'm going to try to continue doing like what I did today, you know, pushing and like really cutting down like what I've been practicing at like practice. So we have to push like get ready, use the two races, the two meets to get ready for the conference. Maybe work smart and hard. Yeah. I always have like a positive attitude. So it's basically what I like. Oh, my teammates for always just being like bright and fun and we keep it like real but we work hard together but we have fun together so we too have to get well prepared and i think the time from right now to conference is enough for us to do the rectify some of the mistakes we did and be positive to heading to the conference meet.